Okay, this is the end result of my flight simulator. This is my X-Plane 12 uh, with my dash that I created. I've got the honeycomb yoke and throttle quadrant. I do like these. Um, the yoke isn't bad compared to other ones. Um, the next step up in price to kind of get more of a realistic feel is just a lot more than I want to pay. So for the money, this is a really good yoke. I really like my uh, real sim gear uh, GTN 650. It kind of makes a nice uh, realistic simulation compared to the uh, what I have in the airplane, which is this, this exact instrument as my primary GPS. Um, I got the rudder pedals, which I really like as well. Uh, they're reasonably priced. Um, this whole thing is a X-Plane 12, as I said. Uh, the airplane that I fly is a Baron uh, B-55. Um, X-Plane 12 has the B-58, um, so that's the closest, obviously. But um, I've got it set up, you know, similar to how I have in the airplane. I can kind of show you here in this video. You can see, you know, what the airplane actually looks like in flight. But uh, um, with the iPad, uh, I've got my Garmin Pilot. I can set that to simulator mode, and I can shoot approaches. So this thing does shoot approaches. Um, I did use I had the four monitors because of space. I didn't have any on the sides. Um, I used the curve monitors on top. The idea was to kind of have a windshield-like effect, and it kind of does that, but there is a little bit of distortion. Uh, you can kind of see there um, with the different size monitors. So I probably wouldn't do that going forward. Uh, but I'd probably just have the, uh, the front monitors and the, and the side monitors, but uh, it does help. It kind of gives you more of an effect, but really like the system. Um, I could have spent more time on the dash. Uh, you saw the steps that I did there, but uh, this works really good. The dash is really cheap to build, and it holds the, uh, the GTN uh, simulated, G simulated GPS pretty well. So, all in all, it's a great system. I did spend some money on it, um, but um, if you want a flight simulator, this is a great way to go. Thank you.